we are going to start lesson number 4 formatting a document formatting means changing the appearance of a document in order to make it attractive and how can we make our document attractive we can make our document attractive by changing font and its size by highlighting certain words by adjusting line spacing by aligning text on a page by creating bulleted and numbered list by applying border by changing text styles and color by changing text case and by setting margins and tabs okay and children we can format our text using the home tab so children our first topic is changing the font type so the characters of a specific size and design used for typing the text are called fonts okay and microsoft word provides various fonts with different sizes and children the default font type is calligraphy and the default size is 11 point okay so to change the font type first select the text now click on the home tab now click on the drop down arrow next to the font box in the font group then a list of fonts appears here choose the desired font from the displayed font list okay so in this way you can change the font type okay now our next topic is applying bold italic and underline effects the font style options such as bold face italic and underline are used to emphasize the text and catch the readers attention so bold means darker text italic means slanted text and underline means a line under text okay so children bold face makes the selected text darker than the rest of the text italic effect emphasizes the text by slanting it to the right and underline emphasizes text by placing a line under it and we can underline a word or sentence along with spaces okay and to apply any font style effects first select the text okay and now click on the button b or i or u in the font group on the home tab okay and children there are variety of formatting options available in word simply click on the font dialog box launcher in the font group on the home tab and select the desired option from the resulting font dialog box okay now the next topic is Microsoft Word provides four types of alignments. Okay, which are aligned text left, center align, aligned text right, and justify align. Okay, 
so to change the alignment of the text first select the text now click on the home tab and click on one of the alignment options in the paragraph group if we click on the align text left button the text is aligned up at the left margin okay and by default the text is always aligned to the left margin if we click on the center align button the text is centered in between the left and right margins in each line okay and it is mostly used for titles and headings if we click on the align text right button the text is aligned up at the right margin and it is often used for placing dates or reference in a document if we click on the justify button the text is aligned up at the left as well as at the right margin and it is mainly used for designing books magazines and newspapers we can also change the text alignment using the paragraph dialog box so click on the paragraph dialog box launcher either on the home tab or page layout tab the paragraph dialog box appears now select the required alignment by clicking on the drop down arrow next to the alignment option under general section okay now the next topic is changing text color microsoft word provides an option to change the color of the text okay and to change the color of the text first select the text and click on the home tab now click on the drop down arrow next to the font color button on the font group and select the desired color from the displayed font color menu okay so in this way we can change the color of the text okay so children i hope you all have understood these topics and we will discuss the remaining topics in the next video okay